Hi people and I'm back cooking again and today I'm going to be doing a little savoury meal. I was uh, flicking through uh, internet and this recipe just jumped up and I thought I'll do it and what it said was to melt some butter in a dish that is a dish and that is melted butter and then it said to coat you still recording yes then it said to coat every every oh whatever it is muffin dish with water with water with oil oil hold on I'm getting confused coat every dish with butter that's it I didn't show you the, the putting butter in but you all know what butter I use anyway so I'm just coating every every bun case muffin case whatever you want to call it it, it is a muffin tin I could use the other one but can't be bothered to get that out because it takes too much room up. So that's every one of them all done. Now it comes to the cracking egg bit. Now I'm no good at this so I will show them you in my egg cracking cup. Sorry, egg cracking cup. I'm not going to show you every egg I crack, I'm just going to show you, um, it does say to put them in like that. So what I'm going to do is, I'm just going to, like I've done that with that one, I'm going to put every, every one in, well I've got six eggs, six compartments, one already in, so I'm just going to crack the other eggs, get back and show you. Right, now you can see I have cracked six eggs in each different compartment. Doesn't matter whether they break up or not. What I'm going to do now is I'm going to cut some ham up. That says ham. Um, where's my cheese? I've already cut some, well I have any cheese I tried to grate it but like a stupid idiot I put it in the freezer and you cannot grate cheese once it's been in the freezer it will break up that's why mine is in big bits and small bits because it just well you can see it's just breaking up in my hands can you see that am I too high I'm too bloody high look <laughs> just breaking up in my hands you know, big bits, small bits. So what's that? Why did that get in? So yeah. But anyway, it's broke up to the best I can do it. But like I said, that's a big bit there. Look, it just look, breaking up in my hands. There's nothing you can do. You can't grate frozen cheese. Well, you probably can. They probably either way, but should have bought grub grated cheese. So anyway, that's five. No, not five, okay? There's six. So there's six six eggs in the tray. Right, we still haven't got any further because I haven't got a clue what I'm doing. Uh, uh, right, yeah. So, I've cut the ham up. That would be good. I did, I will admit, I did change knives because I was scared of cutting my fingers. So I went and bought, got a bought, went and got a, a different knife. So I'm in them. Oops, that's a big piece that shouldn't be in. But not to worry. Cover them all over with ham. I was going to show you the ingredients of everything, but. Uh, well, if I say something, somewhere it'll get said, so... 
That's it. Right, so a bit of ham underneath there. And I'm going to put you're all watching this, aren't you? It's not on standby, is it? Is it? No, it's on record. I'm just gonna move. Is it? Don't move. Yeah. And then the poor attempt of of great cheese is not happen. Right, I'm going to put it on just three of them. Oh, you've not hardly got any cheese in on you. There we are. Love cheese. Now, I'm not sure, I'm not 100% sure, but it does say and the recipe to get a bowl pour the cream in well I've been told Emily isn't cream but it says cream on it so I'm thinking yeah that's all right and it says to give it a whisk now like a stupid idiot I throw my whisk away <laughs> I'll throw my whisk away never mind not to worry so what I'm going to do is my beater from my mixer first I'm going to put some I hope if you can see bloody bowl oh no no, no hold on right done it's a new camcorder new camera and I can't get used to it yet so salt it says put plenty of salt in and a bit of pepper well, that was a bit and give it a good mix how can you mix just cream all right so that's some that's had a mix that's had a mix and now it says to pour it on the uh oof -a -doof -a stuff Gonna overflow. I know it is. Bit of cream on that. Uh, all I'm gonna do is just put. You can't see what the. Oh, we can now. I'm just pouring. Oops. Right, now it says to sprinkle, not frozen, but it does say to sprinkle some spring onions. Now, I know a lot of you have said you're wasting the onions, so what I did were, I went and bought some onions this morning, and I got them home, and I I cut them up, and I defrosted it. I, fro I froze them. So... I don't like too many spring onions. So we'll put them then. Then that's not got. Get off! Uh, excuse me. Thank you. Put some on the ones that haven't got cheese on. Because the ones with cheese on are mine. I don't want too many spring onions because I'm not keen on them. Oh, look at that, eh? A bunch of spring onions all to go in bin because I've got no use for them. <gasps> oh, so, I'm going to put them in the oven. Oh. Oh. My paper's here. Put them in the oven for 20 minutes or 180. 20, 20 minutes or 180. 180 is... is, is, is oh wait if you ever go away you do my head in 180 in electric i can't tell you gas because i don't know 
probably about two, three, I don't know, four maybe. So yes, let's see if the oven is warm enough to put them in. Now they're out of the oven and they are done. Let's just check. Try with a knife in right in the middle. Yeah, apart from these two end ones, they need to go back in. So I shall pinch one that was done, which was that one, I think. Let's just check. Right, my mistake, they are all done. I've just scooped it out with a spoon because the knife was breaking it up. So that is your end product. Now I have cut it up and you can see the, probably not the inside, but yes, it's all done anyway. So now I'm going to try it. Hold on, spring honey in there, get that top. Oh dear, too much salt but lovely. Well in case it was nice, a bit salty but I did put a lot of, you saw I did put a lot of salty, salty, I can't think of the word, salty, I put I did put a lot of salty in for a little bit of mixture, so, oh, there's going to be a link in the description to my merchandise, excuse me one minute, <coughs> uh, if you like what you see please keep viewing me, if you want to, Give me a thumbs up, please do. If you want to leave a comment and a recipe, recipe please feel free, the more the merrier. And if you haven't subscribed, or you know someone who hasn't subscribed, get them subscribing, get yourself subscribing, get everybody subscribing. Thank you. Bye.